July Gauntlet 2 is definitely one of the more annoying gauntlets. So it starts off with a Metal Hippo, along with some occasional Dark Doges as well as Metal Doges and Gory Blacks. These are pretty easy to take care of with the help of Pizza Cat and Dark Laser. I have the Wave Talents on both of them. I think it's very helpful, but if you don't have them, you should be fine. Uh, so before a base hit, that's all that spawns. These spawn periodically. Not too difficult to take care of. I would say don't deploy your Waitress Cat or your Catasaurus until after Metal Hippo dies because the main reason you brought critical hitters is because on base hit a Metal One Horn spawns along with the main boss that being Selena. She's this really just uh, cursed looking black dog enemy type thing. She has a lot of health with only 3 knockback counts and 270 range. Selena dishes out 45,000 damage per hit. This insta kills everything in my roster except Talented Dark Laser just because I have the health up talents. Although Selena does outrange Bomber Cat, after you kill the Metal One Horn, it's pretty easy to get Bomber to get a hit in on Selena, and as long as you can get two Bomber Cats together, they permafreeze her, which is extremely helpful, and that's how I won this stage. I can imagine it's a lot harder if you can't get your Bomber Cat to time correctly, but I really didn't think it was very difficult. The hardest part for me was getting Waitress to hit the Metal One Horn, because she kept hitting the Metal Dogs in front of it the first time, or just getting knocked backwards, but eventually the Metal One Horn will die, and after that, as long as you can take care of the peon spam and get a bomber cat to hit Selena, it should be smooth sailing from there. If you're still having trouble with the stage, please leave a comment and I'll try to help the best I can. And have a good day. See you in the next video.